first take a look at the minute hand then see just where it lands next you're gonna count by five and that will give you the right time we're gonna rock and rock around the clock tonight start at the one that is five two is ten three is fifteen four is twenty Five is twenty-five, six is thirty, seven is thirty-five, eight is forty-nine is forty-five. Ten is fifty, eleven is fifty-five, when the hand hits twelve we say o'clock. We're gonna rock, rock, rock the clock. We're gonna rock, rock, rock around the clock. We're gonna rock, rock, rock around the clock tonight. Good morning, everyone. I hope your day is going well. It's good to see you again. So when you're learning to tell time, there are two different hands on a clock. Who can tell me what they're called? Yes, that's right. One's the hour hand. That's the short hand that's on the clock. If you look up here, the short hand, that's the hour hand. And the other one is called the, right, the minute hand. And if you look at the clock, the minute hand is the long hand on the clock. And that's the hand that we're gonna focus on first, the minute hand. Yeah, so let's look up at this clock, the clock I have behind me. Yeah, so if we start with the one, one is five, two is 10, three is 15, four is 20, five is 25, six is 30, seven is 35, eight is 40, nine is 45, 10 is 50, 11 is 55, and then when we get to 12, we don't say zero, even though, well, or we don't say 60. We say, what do we say when the clock is on 12? The minute hand is on 12. O'clock, yeah, we say o'clock. So if you can count by fives, which I know you can, then you can always figure out what time of day it is. I'm gonna snap my fingers and a new clock is gonna pop up there. Let's do a quick little quiz. We'll just go around the clock like we did in our song. Okay, if the minute hand is on one, how many minutes past the hour is it? You said five, good job, that's right. Okay, now, the minute hand is gonna move to the two. If the minute hand is on the two, how many minutes past the hour is it? Good job, if you said 10, that is right. Okay, now we're gonna move the minute hand to the three. If the minute hand is on the three, how many minutes past the hour is it? 15, if you said 15, that's right. Okay, now the minute hand is on the four. How many minutes past the hour is it if the minute hand is on the four? Good job, that's right, if you said 20, 20 minutes. All right, now let's go to the five. The minute hand is pointing to the five. How many minutes after the hour is it? 25, that's right. All right, now the minute hand is on the six. How many minutes past the hour is it? 30, that's right, good job. 
Okay, now the minute hand is on the seven. How many minutes past the hour is it? How many? 35, that's right. Awesome. All right, now the minute hand is on the eight. How many minutes past the hour is it now? If you said 40, that is absolutely correct. Good job. All right, now the minute hand is on the nine. How many minutes past the hour is it? Good, that's right. 45 minutes, 45. Now the minute hand is on the 10. How many minutes past the hour is it? Hmm. 50, good job, 50 minutes. All right, now the minute hand is on the 11. How many minutes past the hour is it? Hmm. 55, yay, you got it right. Okay, now the minute hand is on the 12. What did we say for that? Good job. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you some times and I wanna see if you can get it right. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. Okay, so first, look at the hour hand. That tells you the hour. The hour hand is the short hand, the little, the, the shorter one. Yeah, okay, so look at my clock. What number is the little hand or the hour hand pointing to? Good job, that's right. Okay, and now to figure out how many minutes it is past the hour, we're gonna count by five. Hmm. So remember, first find the minute hand. Okay, and then we're gonna count to figure that out. Are you ready? Okay, now count the minutes. Good job, you got it right. Okay, we're gonna try that again. So I'm gonna show you a new time, ready? We're gonna snap our fingers. There's a new time on the clock. Okay, first look at the hour hand, the short hand. What is the hour? Good job. Okay, now Look at the minute hand, the longer hand. And you're gonna count by fives. Figure it out. Good job. You're so smart. You're so good at this. You're working really hard to figure it out. I think that's awesome. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna give you a new clock. Boink. What? time is it now? Okay, first remember, look at the hour. The short hand is the hour hand. So what's the hour? Yeah, good. What's the minute hand pointing to? Remember, count around the clock, count by fives. What time is it? Yes, very good. Okay, we're gonna do it again. New clock. First look at the hour hand to get to the hour. What is the hour? Good job. Okay, now look at the minute hand, the longer hand. And you're gonna count by fives. Figure it out. Good job. Okay, we're gonna do it again. New clock. First look at the hour hand to get to the hour. What is the hour? 
Good job. Okay, now look at the minute hand, the longer hand. And you're gonna count by fives to figure it out. Good job. Awesome, you're getting really good at this. I hope you'll keep practicing. Everyone can get good at telling time, it just takes practice. Thanks for talking to me today. Have a good one. Bye.